All right, folks, bear with me just a few more minutes. Another request, and I'm not hearing you. Yeah, probably going to have to. I just went live. Okay. Folks, all right, I'm back, but I'm still still working on getting programs up. Uh, the, my whole system ended up crashing on me, so I do apologize. All is actually well. I don't know what happened, but um, it could easily be that my system was over, overworked from all uh, working all day. So... But we're up here and running. Let me check to make sure the headphones. Yes, game game sounds are on. Let's launch the. Uh, we make it a uh, an echo because um, the program that I'm launching right now tends to make an echo here. So here, bear so with me. Bear with yep, me. There it is. Yep, there it is. All right. All right. So come so on. Come, come on. on, come on. There we go. There we go. Got that got that. Got this, got this, and, and devices, device. refresh. There we go. Don't have to worry about that anymore. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, hey, the wolf decided to go back over to the left side. Let's go back over to the right side. How about that? <laughs> All right. Yes, there we go there. Now we get up origin. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that's... You don't know the power of the dark side. Kawaii Pun, thank you very much for that host. I do so very much appreciate it. Oh boy, I'm going to have to get uh, this up. How are you doing? Thank you. And everyone watching from Kawaii Pun, thank you very much for being here. I am just recovering from a system crash. And it's causing me to uh, reload everything. And I mean everything. Carly's Entertainment. Hey, welcome, welcome. Games. Go down to Origin. Copy password. Enter password. Sign in. Ah. All right. Minimize that. Carly and Kawaii, how are you guys doing today? I'm bringing Dragon Age 2 right back up. There we go. Oh, also forgot to do something. This is what actually crashed the system. Nope, I can do this later. All right, let's see how this is working. Okay, this is now working. This is good. This is good. How is, oh yes, there it is. Okay, so we do have the closed captioning. All right, folks, the closed captioning that you see down at the bottom left, it is an overlay. You can move it and resize it however you wish. It's not on. It's on mine. Refresh. Oh, for some reason it got turned off on my end. Ah, okay. So this uh, overlay is uh, something that I got. Um, it works through um, Google Chrome, actually. It's pretty damn good. I like actually what it's doing. And the fact you guys can move it to wherever you want. Okay, Kawhi and Carly, do I need to send you to the opposite sides of the lair? 
<laughs> it's okay. Well, thank you very much for um, getting Kawhi to host me. I do appreciate it. All right. All right, so let's go ahead and see where we see what happens when we go back into the game. Oh, also, I found out I apparently don't have some DLCs. I thought I did. Guys, uh, I'll check this weekend as to whether or not I can get the new D the DLCs and whether or not that's going to be an issue. All right. Okay, good. So we start right here. Not bad. Hmm. I do apologize, but dinner is dinner. What's this? Oh. All right. What's the way? Oh, that's mine. Yes, I named my Mabari my after myself. There we go. All right. So what are you guys all up to other than watching me play some Dragon Age 2? How are you guys doing? Everyone. Okay. So that one right there, Sten. If I, my memory is correct, he is from the first Dragon Age. Unlock two more achievements on Twitch. Nice! Congratulations. Dendens. What is Dendens? I just had Den. Uh, I just had Dendens Den myself, and it was a nice, uh, it was a great ham sandwich. I'm eating the uh, chips slowly because I don't want to keep crunching all the time. Okay, we're good. No, we're not. Hold. You will surrender the relic. I don't have your stupid relic. The boss has no honor. to the canary and there's a small oh. chance they want it back <laughs> really yeah thank tell me what you know you can trust me i've always known what the relic is i just didn't want to worry you 
The relic is a Canari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Kesland, Kuzland, whatever his name is. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim yeah. it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. And they can't leave without it. All of this could have been avoided. All right, investigate. You stole it? How did you steal the relic from the Canari? The Arashok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had plans to return it to the Canari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arashok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe giving it back would solve Abilene's problem. It couldn't hurt. Says you. I know it will save my skin. Ah. Oh, why can't this be as easy as you? Okay. Okay. <laughs> why would anyone besides the Canari want this relic? The Tavinta Imperium have been at war with the Canari for centuries. If the Tavintas get the relic, it will strike a blow to Canari morale. That's probably what the mages want. Okay. What about the shipwreck? I thought you and the Canari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Canari Dreadlord stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. This is your mess. All over a book? How could you be so selfish? You could have done something about the Canari, but you didn't. Done what? The blighted thing didn't show up for three years. Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. There's more at stake, but... Well, the Arash will wait up this long. Oh, I don't know. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. Okay. My information says I should do this and she'll actually like it. But then again, that could be wrong. It's yours. Your life depends on it. Really? I wasn't expecting that. It's nice to have someone on my side for once. Don't make us regret it. Come on, we've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I, uh, I have it. The Tome of Coastland will not fall into Deventer hands. Blood and spite. A toss, Kanari! Okay. He's away. Isabella. Stands back. Ouch. Uh, I need to heal. Okay. Got you. So Sten came back. Apparently we didn't kill him. Which is actually good. Uh, let's see here. And to turn off Bloods better when I played the first one, it drove me crazy. Yeah, it does. Nice. Bullet, you're getting there. All right. 
right, so this is the way I have to go. Ah! But hey, for the time frame this was built, this was done, this is actually really good. The blood spatter in both one and two are really good. How long do I think is, is left what? Before you hit three, uh, three viewers average? Or in the game? Isabella's letter. Dear Hawk, I have the relic and I am gone. I'm sorry it has to be this way. You've been a loyal ally, but this is best for us both. You promised me the relic, and now I know you'll fight Castellan for me. But I don't want this. I've dragged you far, uh, too far in this mess already. You don't have to forgive me, but I hope you understand. Uh, honestly, Bullet, there would be a lot. There's a lot of things I'd have to look at to tell you what a guess would be. Uh, to be honest, when I got to three viewers per av uh, average over 30 days, I was at dinner, not even streaming. <laughs> So, uh, it all depends on if you take take a look at your viewers over the last 30 days. And you'll see the when you have the low spots, if they drop off, that'll jump your average up. And if it goes over three, you get it. She's okay. Gone. She took it. That bitch-born whore. Well, now we get to deal with the Arashok and the fugitives ourselves. That's good. That's enough. Let's go to the compound. Alright. All right, we're going here first. And we're going to leave. Huh. All right. Let's go to the docks. up any other business before we go it's already a mess it could get worse i still have things i need to do don't forget as soon as you're finished wrapping up your business we'll need to go to the canary compound together don't worry you're with me anyway oh hey i can level up um my dex needed to go up last time I knew I remember. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, for her, let's give her some more health. Um...
Sharky's he's using the stand mixer in the kitchen, so I'm drop a lurk and hide in the bedroom until she's done too late. Oh, okay. Not a problem. I understand. Uh, let's see here. Oh, let's see here. Through sheer... Yeah, I'll go ahead and use that. I'll do that. Because that moves to what we need. Okay. Let's bring his dexterity up. And his cunning up. Got two ability points. As a merchant prince, uh, physical damage over time. Nobody puts in long hours like a dwarf. Mana stamina regeneration plus 10%. Okay. Okay, um... Let's do a kickback. And... Backlash. All right. Well, there's, we gotta try this other place. This other quest, let's go. Blondie, Sunshine, Daisy, Ravaney, what am I? Beg your pardon? You don't huh. call anyone by name except for me. Where's my nickname? That's not true. There's Hawk and Bianca. Hawk is a family name, and Bianca is a crossbow. Don't change the subject. <laughs> haven't thought of a good one yet. What do you think of red? Too common. Well, when you think of one, let me know. All right, let's go this way. I'm going to check everything I can because over in this section there is a plant that I need to get and I don't know where it is. Out of my way, dwarf. Not there. Not there. Not there. There. Okay. Hey, what's this? Shark bow. What's this? Superior dagger. All right. Ah, pile of bones. All right. 
about here. So my isolated little hometown has first confirmed case of COVID. In, in a release from the hospital, they make comment that it's just the first one. one. One of the responses is, I so wish people wouldn't use phrase like, this is just the first one. Why not say, let's pray that this is the only one? Because others will get it and get sick if they aren't already infected. It's a matter of when they will have more, if not. It also is a matter of when they get tested and symptoms develop, things like that. No, very true. I agree with you. But people want a way to say that it's a fluke. They are the they are better that they are they're luckier than others. Let them have that hope. No, we're not going to go that way hey what do we have here I hadn't picked that up before Use a vendor. I will have to remember this. There it is. Got it. Let's see here. What am I at? 62 of 70. Actually, let me go to that vendor. Sell all junk. I went from 62 out of 70 to 46 out of 70. Okay. Now let's go back to the city, finish this quest, and then go um, do some selling and then come back here. Oh, wait. No, I can go ahead and do this. I'm just going to go ahead and save. Ah. All right, let's see how well we do. Last time we didn't do too well, but we've leveled up once or twice since. know each other. Harley is one of the guard, recently promoted. This disaster was my first routine assignment. Uh-huh. We're not reinforcements, if that's what you're waiting for. Bollocks. Little Brennan must not have made it back. We're up against Evett's marauders. You're certain about that? Del Orden's up there, and Victor Longdeath's handiwork you've already seen. We tried two sorties up the path, but it's trapped to oblivion. 
Now I'd be thankful just to get out of here alive. No fair, guard dog! You brought friends! Shut your mouth! <laughs> okay. Who are we dealing with? Fair order. Victor Longdeath, what are you talking about? They have been robbing and raping the Maker knows how long. Did a broad daylight assault on the keep to rescue one of their number two years back. Fell Orden, a blood mage, is here. Victor Longdeath, Sophie. Maker, you certainly drew a fine first detail. Uh huh. Isn't it suicide to stay pinned down here? We're pinned down right now, but so are they. If we run, Everts Marauders escape again. So we've been waiting for reinforcements. Victor's arrows and Auden's fireballs taking their toll. But we can still take them down. Okay. Well, last time we did this, we had problems, even though we attacked together. So let's still attack together. The longer we wait, the more of us they'll kill. Let's attack now. I'm with you, but my men may be too rattled to join us. I'll give Evans them hope. Marauders. They're just men. Flesh and bone. Flesh can be torn. Bones can be broken. Alone, they will pick you off one by one. Together, we are unstoppable. On me! You'd make a fine captain of the guard. Look out for traps. Be careful. Everts Marauders are deadly. Damn it! Tell Lieutenant Jalen at the keep what you've done. I'll make sure he rewards you. Good work yourself, Lieutenant. Make sure the others know it. Men, we're heading home. All right. Nice. All right, attributes. I'm calm. Okay. Got that. Bring his dexterity up. And give him that one. Okay, let's switch back to me. All right. Search over here. Yep, there's some coin. Watch your step. Poor sunshine. Bartman will pay for her oh, death, I promise you.
<laughs> All right. Okay, let's see here. Anything else? Trap. So that should do it. Take care of those traps. Delish longbow, nice. I don't like the looks of this. Ouch. See if there's traps this way. Nope, no traps. All right. Let's go turn in a couple things and then we will go ahead and move on with the Canari. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's go to the gallows for the herbalist tasks. That's a quick thing. Oh, cheer up, Blondie. You're making me cry just looking at you. Don't. You made a mistake. It happens. I almost killed a girl. You've killed 254 by my last count, plus about 500 men, a few dozen giant spiders, and at least two demons. It's not the same. <laughs> Why? Because this one you feel bad about? Maybe that's the problem. Brilliant. I'm amazed you found everything. My craft can begin anew. Your reward, my young friend. All right. here Lieutenant Harley said I should see you about a reward that's it not even going to mention your scuffle with Evitz marauders killing the whole lot of them I wish I'd been there sooner they killed a lot of good people they won't kill anyone else, thanks to you. There's one small rub, though. Their leader, Evitz, wasn't there, was he? No, they were led by fell orders. Evitz is the worst of the lot. He may try to get revenge one day. Okay. I can be careful. Good to know. I'll keep an eye out for him. Maybe nothing will come of it. Thanks again for your help. Okay. For a minute, I thought it was going to give me a new quest. All right, we're going back here. Going back to the house, secure my uh, ailments. <laughs> okay. This should be interesting. That's a tiny cut there. All 
right, let's take a look at his staff. Twenty-eight mana Stanima, five mana generation rate. So is twenty-eight mana Stanima? Yeah, it is. So 151 armor plus 81 attack. All right, this helm. Okay, 17 attack plus one critical. Six percent critical damage. Well, that one gets put on. Ring of the Archmage. Let's check this guy. Amulet of Ashes. Pewter Pendant of Wolves Howling at the Moon. 22 attack. Guardia. Huh? Ring of the Archmage. Rival Seer Band. Ring. Ornate Rogue's Ring. All right. We go in. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, we don't. Maybelline. Weapons. Plus four electricity. Nope, the sword's better. All right, let's go. I'd wrap up any other business before we go. It's already a mess. It could get worse. I'm ready. Let's go. I request an audience with the Irish shop. He will allow it. But not in this number. I will only bring my friend here and a small compliment of my guard. Is that few enough? It is. Enter. Okay. This should be interesting. Cool. Glad to see that, Floor Quester. I'm pretty sure you'll love him. Sinead. Greetings, Arashok. We come regarding the elven fugitives that took refuge here. Irrelevant. I would speak to Hawk about the relics stolen from my grasp. One of my former companions stole it. Her part was clear. Your admission is welcome. An issue for another time. We're here for the fugitives. The elves are now Fidifari. They have chosen to submit to the cure. They will be protected. Uh, let's see, a rise 20th anniversary is only nine bucks on Steam, includes the season pass. Yeah, no, you can't pass that up. That's a great deal. Surely you know these elves are only here to escape justice. Kirkwall justice. You have not hidden the abuses of your zealots or the corruption of this city. You will understand why I must do this. Let us look at your dangerous criminals. Speak, Vidathari. Who did you murder and why? A city guard forced himself on our sister. We reported him, or tried to, but they did nothing about it. No matter what we said, 
So my brothers and I paid him a visit. That doesn't excuse murder. Are these elves telling the truth? There have been rumors. I will investigate. But they still took the law into their own hands. Sometimes that is necessary. Like you avenged the Viscount's son. It was not right then, and it's not right now. What these men did was wrong. Their actions are mere symptoms. Your society is the disease. They have chosen. The Vidathari will submit to the Kune and find a path your way has denied them. You can't just decide that. You must hand them over. I'd let us arrest them. Why? Because we can also say, hey, they're going to go to the coon and learn a better way to do it. Maybe that will um, give them some extra and they also have extra time to think about it. As a guest in the city, I would keep the peace. I see. I cannot leave without the relic and I cannot stay and remain blind to this dysfunction. There is only one solution. Arishok, there is no need for. Vinek Kathas. Okay, gotta love that. Can you hear it? The Canari must be spreading out. They're attacking the city. Why? What could they possibly hope to accomplish? It doesn't matter. We need to act. I agree. We can't do anything on our own, however. Okay. Dark Town is flooded with people trying to get away from all this. The Canari are assaulting the city and fast. The Arashok planned this for who knows how long. Okay. We should head to the keep to rally my guardsmen. Whatever happens, be careful. Good health potions, I'm gonna need them. All right, 
Well, let's go. Come on. You have our sincere thanks. This attack was most unexpected. We have not met. I am Stroud of the Grey Wardens. Uh oh. I cannot believe the Kunari would dare such an attack. This will lead to war with the Free Marches for certain. I fear pressing matters take us elsewhere, but we can spread word to the other free cities. Perhaps they will bring aid. Pressing matters? There's something more important than an invasion. There is, but I cannot say more. The Kunari are of far greater concern to you, I'm certain. But we must return to our mission. Fight with us. We could use your help defending the city. Even if we wish to. Grey Wardens cannot involve themselves in political struggles. I am sorry. Take this. It is all we can spare, but perhaps it will be of use. Okay. Make her watch over you, my friend. Okay. Loot what we can. Okay. All right. How do I know we're going to have more? Hey, attack that one. Here we go. It's too much. Using All right. Sten. Man, we keep me meeting up with Stens. I wonder if it's just different Sten, uh, diff just a common name. Cuz I know I've killed him at least 3 times. 
Maybe four. Yep. We move on. Nope, not unfortunate for us. So we finally meet her. I know you. The name Hawk has turned up in my reports many times. Too many. It's good that we found you, Knight Commander. The Canari are... It's obvious what they're doing. The Canari are taking people to the Keep and may already be in control. We will need to deal with them. Why the Keep? Why would they be gathering hostages? To get everyone important in one place where they can be controlled or killed. Charming. I'll do whatever it takes to defend my home. Good. Your skills will be sorely needed. Head to the keep and I will see if I can find more of my men. These creatures will pay for this outrage. Okay. Oh, wow. Interesting. Okay. Almost forgot. There's things to loot. Let's go. Oh, hello. Got you. One less to worry about. Woo. 
Oh, there's a box. I hit the flame five feet away. Ah, oh, there's another box. Yeah, Glory Quester, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure what you're specifically talking about because I have not actually got into uh, truck truck simulator. Nice. That is a good thing. Oh, hey, there's something. Are you all right? You don't seem as badly injured as the others. The others? Surely they cannot all be. Gone. I told them to run. First enchanter or Sino. You survived. Overwhelms me, Knight Commander. Okay. There is no time for talk. We must strike back before it's too late. And who will lead us into this battle? You? I will fight to defend this city as I have always done. To control it, you mean? I won't have our lives tossed to the flames to feed your vanity. We need to work together. Not kill each other while we figure out who leads. Then, perhaps you should be leading us. What? She is leaving of this city. Neither am I. Yet I don't hear you complaining about us both fighting to defend our home. Very well, then. But whatever you plan, be quick about it. Tell us, then. What is our course of action? Uh, not get killed? Let's get to the keep. We need to be careful. Let's find out what the Cunari are planning not to risk our necks in the process. An excellent choice. Let's move quickly. Okay. I didn't get to loot all of that. There's loot there. Let me loot. entrance then they've already taken it over clearly they've been planning this for some time i don't see any of my guardsmen this is the only way in we must assault them now before their numbers grow are you mad they have hostages we need a distraction decide quickly we have no time we need the distraction a direct assault is too risky We'll need to get you inside and catch up as soon as we can. 
And just how will we do this? Have confidence, Knight Commander. Okay, this should be interesting. You will not conquer this city without a fight. Cerebos! Okay, I think we took pick the right thing to do. Yep. It is virtual, but it's still good. Got you. No more fire from behind. Health potions. We need more health potions. I think I need to give that to Aveline. Okay. Thirteen defense, nine armor, two health. Her new ability actually does the same thing. Oh, great. All right. Your fight, You dare? You are starting a war. Look at you. Like fat duff Russi, you feed and feed and complain only when your meal is interrupted. You do not look up. You do not see that the grass is bare. All you leave in your wake is misery. You are blind. I will make you see. But we have guests. Sinead Hawk. 
I expected you. But for all your might, you are no different from these bars. You do not see. Oh, yes, I do. We can still work this out. Perhaps. Prove yourself, Basra, or kneel with your brethren. such respect. So tell me, Hawk. You know I am denied Parvalin until the Tome of Kosloon is found. How would you see this conflict resolved without it? I believe I can answer that. I'm sure you'll find it mostly undamaged. The Tome of Kosloon. It took me a while to get back, what with all the fighting everywhere. You know how it is. I thought you'd be long gone by now. This is your damned influence, Hawk. <laughs> I was halfway to Ostwick before I knew I had to turn round. It's pathetic. The relic is reclaimed. I am now free to return to Parvalin. With the thief. What? Oh, no, no, no. If anyone kicks her ass, it's me. She stole the Tome of Kosloon. She must return with us. Sounds like you have something very specific in mind. She will submit to the tune and the Van Hasrat. More than that, I will not say. No. You have your relic. She stays with us. I'm sure he'll take that well. Ravani, you might want to move a bit this way. Then you leave me no choice. I challenge you, Hawk. You and I will battle to the death with her as the prize. No. If you're going to duel anyone, duel me. You are not Basilidan. You are unworthy. Don't you have what you came for? You know we do not suffer thieves. She cannot walk away from this insult. I will take her. If you object, duty demands that we fight. I accept your challenge. Maravas! So shall it be! Okay, this is not easy. I actually got him down to a quarter health. Ah. <sighs> Well, let's do this again. Let's call the map Arian.
Come on. Okay. Oh, before I go that way, I'm actually going to save. I also want to check up here. No, nothing. Didn't think so. Alright, we're going to save. Let's see here. Does this do 23 attack, 2 health regeneration? You know what? Actually, I'm going to take that. Okay. Four critical damage, three physical damage, three percent magic resistance. Okay, that's the same thing. Amulet of Ashes. Don't need fire damage. Band of Stolen Shadows. Oh, that's the one that I replaced. My belt. Hindsight. Armor. Fire resistance. Twenty-six attack. Four nature damage. Twenty-six attack. Let's do that. of Insolin. Balance of a shard. Bullet. How's the three weeks isolating treating you? Um, honestly, right now, it's not doing too much different than what I normally do. Um, we're not fully isolated. Uh, there is no quarantine where uh, we cannot go out and accept in certain circumstances at this point. It's just, hey, don't congregate. Uh, if you are seen this way, they will take action. Things like that. So it's actually not bad here. Uh, there are other states that are much heavier, heavier hit, and they are California, Washington State, as well as New York. And both, all three of those are major hubs of activity. Washington, not so much, but California, definitely. Okay. Don't have any boots that do anything. The helmet there. Okay, let me make sure my weapons. Oh, 
let's see here. Honeycut's actually pretty good. Is that better? Because that I, I reduced three percent tax speed. No, we're going to keep the tax speed. Okay. Ah. Let's save one more time. All right. Let's see if this saves. See if we can save it. Dog, Hawk. But for all your might, you are no different from these bars. You do not see. We can still work this out. Perhaps prove yourself, Basra, or kneel with your brethren. Okay, what will you Sounds do? Sounds like you have something very specific in mind. She will submit to the Kuhn and the Ben Hasroth. More than that, I will not say. No, we will do it. Isabella will answer according to our laws, not yours. Then you leave me no choice. I challenge you, Hawk. You and I will battle to the death with her as the prize. No. If you're going to duel anyone, duel me. You are not Basili Dan. You are unworthy. I refuse your challenge. Then all of you will die. The demand of the Kune is clear. Atash Varim Kata. In the end lies glory.
Got you. And they were just standing there throughout the whole thing. Gotta love it. <laughs> Is it over? It's over. The city has been saved! Okay. Yeah, literally, Floof. <laughs> How you doing, Floof? You seem confused, Seeker. It just seems so unbelievable. I would have assumed the stories were exaggerated. If I didn't know better, I'd say you've developed a case of hero worship. Why? Because I have respect for a woman who built herself from nothing? Mm-hmm. If you're telling the truth. If you are, then... What happened at the gallows may be far different than we assumed. I need to hear it. Let's say I tell you. Then what? Is the Chantry out for revenge? Is that what this is all about? No, it's not that. Then what about me? If what I tell you isn't what you want to hear, will you still let me go? I will let you go. Well, now we're talking. None of this is what I thought it would be. Tell me what really happened. Champion of Kirkwall. That was the reward. <laughs> A fine title. Every noble at the keep owed the champion their lives. She wasn't just a hero. She was now the most important person in the city. Except for Knight Commander Meredith, of course. With the Viscount dead, she stepped in to keep order. Things quickly got out of hand. No oh, joy. The more she squeezed the mages, the more they resisted. The more they resisted, the tighter she squeezed. Three years of that, it all came crashing down. I know you fear us. Knight Commander Meredith uses that fear to take control of your city. She opposes every effort to replace Viscount Dumas. And you have seen the chaos of her reign. Will you allow it? No. Return to your homes. This farce is over. Wait! Perhaps there are some who might disagree with you, Knight Commander. Oh, Do boy. not hide behind the champion. She has no role in this. I like a good debate. Uh, so the council closed the car park entrances to the beach and some now and and now someone removed the barricade so cars can park there and there is a there's multi cars even going even people on the beach i know uh bullet we had the same thing happen here in florida a whole bunch of uh ca college kids decided they're going to have their spring break anyway and gathered in major numbers and all of a sudden they said oh we don't care if we get it now they have it and it's not good uh, folks give me a few moments here i'm going to step away from the keyboard i'm going to um grab something to drink and i'll be right back
All right, folks, I'm back, but we got one thing. I'm trying to figure out why it's doing this. Let me check something because I have a feeling it's going to give me some other problems. Okay, that didn't come up. Let me try it one more time. Logitech, gaming software. There it is. Okay, so now we go ahead and continue. Let us see. Maybe I could help. Love a good debate. Huh. I can think for myself. Yeah, Floof. Um, had an issue earlier. System rebooted, but my keyboard driver, uh, keyboard program didn't jump up into uh, startup. And I kind of re feel, figured it out just a few minutes ago. Just as I, right now, on stream, actually. So, got a dot. It's working. All right, let's see here. It would be better if you both calm down before this gets violent. I should remain calm while a mage provokes an uprising. I think not. I think the champion's views would be appreciated. Or do you fear what she has to say? I fear nothing. My only interest here is in keeping order and protecting the innocent. Okay. Why do this now? Do the Templars go too uh, do the Templars go too far? Answer is charges. Alright, let's The first enchanter accused you of trying to take control of the city. The city? I am trying to keep order until there is a ruler capable of succeeding where Duma failed. And if not, will the Templars rule Kirkwall forever? We will not stand idle while the city burns around us. The Templar Order exists to guard the Chantry and Circle. I suggest you let the nobility rule the city. I do not need you or anyone to tell me what my duty is, mage. Meredith needs to step down. Let the city decide. If Kirkwall wants Meredith to step down, they'll tell her to. Are you mad? They fear her. Everyone fears her. Do the Templars go too far? Your measures have become more extreme over the last three years. And you could do better? How well did you guard your own mother? Did she not die at a blood mage's hands? Leave my mother out of this. Cold corpses speak louder than abstract freedoms, do they not? As long as that's true, Kirkwall needs its Templars more than it needs a new ruler. And when will that end? When will you stop seeing evil in every corner? When it's no longer there. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's cool. Uh, let's see here. So, investigate. What are you trying to do here? Cause a rebellion? The people of this city need to know what is really happening. And then what? They tear down the gallows with pitchforks and torches? That would be better? It cannot be worse. Your refusal to listen to reason leaves me no choice. 
what I refuse to listen to are excuses. Perhaps you are ill-fit to your position if you cannot understand this. Threatening each other isn't going to help matters. And what should I do instead? Allow this to continue? Neither of you is right. This won't be resolved here. We need to sit down and work it out. You are naive, champion. You will find that not everyone bows to your will, Knight Commander. My, my. Such a terrible commotion. This mage incites rebellion, Your Grace. I am dealing with the matter. Ah, Orsino. So frustrated. Do you think this is truly wise? I... No, Your Grace. Of course not. Young men, would you show the first enchanter back to the circle? Gently, if you please. Your Grace! He should be clapped in irons! Made an example of! That's enough, Meredith. This... it means us all. Surely you can see that. Go back to the gallows and calm down, like a good girl. Uh-oh. You have my thanks for stepping in, champion. If you had not... Uh -huh. You're the Grand Cleric. Aren't you in charge of the Templars and Circle? Oh, my. You have quite the estimation of my abilities. Ah. Gentle people of Kirkwall, return to your homes, I implore you. This will not be solved today. And now I must attend to the gallows. They will see reason if the Maker wills it. Thank you again, Champion. Okay. All quiet around here, Captain. Good. Carry on. Okay. Nope. We're not where I thought we were. Felt like it. Okay. Okay, get a new ability. The mark of death lingers longer on the assassin's target. Pinpoint strikes. <laughs> and Floof, you know what I, what I think of when I see AC? Alternating current. Or air conditioning. Air conditioning is another one. Oh. All right. Okay. All right. There we go. Nice. All right. Now we've leveled up. Ashron's call. Yeah. The Knight Commander's mad. I wish you really were the Viscount. Oh, interesting. I've got a daughter in the circle. There's a lot of mages in the city who aren't blood mages. 
The Viscount had no heir. Will you take his place, champion? So, the Knight Commander. Boiling in oil? That one never gets old. This is past time for joking. I'm helping you indulge in elaborate revenge fantasies. I think it's good for you. <laughs> Meredith will die. Do not doubt that. Oh, go away, Justice. Can Anders come out and play? Stop. You are no fun anymore. Many Canari fell in Kirkwall when we departed. I am sent to gather their swords. If you find a Canari sword, return it to me. Just their weapons? Don't you want their bodies too? Their husks serve no purpose. The weapons shall satisfy a demand of the Kune. Okay. I shall look for them. I'll keep an eye out. You will find me here. Alright, so we got lost swords. Do you That's... think people will ever start calling it the Hawk Estate? Ah! Something going on over here that I need to see. Somebody to talk to. I don't find a dress this time. I'll be last out of Kirkwall. Ah, the champion of Kirkwall. Your reputation precedes you. Forgive me. I should introduce myself properly. My name is Nancio Caldera Lanos. I am a noble from the beautiful country of Antiva. Oh. Is there something I can help you with? I've come to you in search of aid. An elven assassin I have been chasing is loose in the area. Unfortunately, he's hidden himself among the local Dalish, no doubt playing on their shared heritage. He's a master manipulator who will endanger even his own kind to ensure his survival. Uh, why would a noble hunt him? You don't seem the type to hunt assassins. Why are you after him? At first, it was merely a duty to Antiva. But after losing so many good men to him, it became personal. He's nothing but a murderer, a thief, and a liar. That's smart. Your assassin is no fool. I doubt the Dalish would hand a fellow elf over to you, murderer or no. Ah, so you see my problem. Where that elf goes, death follows. He must be captured quickly. I've heard of your dealings with the Dalish. I was hoping you could go where my men could not. Find out where the assassin is hiding. And apprehend him. Sure. I'll see what I can do. One of the Dalish, a woman named Variel, is a friend of his. I suggest speaking with her first. We won't be here when you get back. We got a campsite outside the city. Look for us there. Okay. Alright, let's see what's going on at the Hawk Estate. Okay, what's going on up here? What's the matter? Easy boy. What is it? All right, let's see. Please don't open the door. You've caught a burglar. Oh, good boy. My legs are cramping. Please, just let me go. Why? You expect me to just let you walk out of here? Please, Sarah. I was seduced by a crime at a very young age. But your guard monster has scared me towards a path of honest work. Mm-hmm. I can be sporting. That sounds so bad. See, I don't know if he's really becoming, uh, doing honest work there. It's the dungeons for you. 
Go fetch a watchman, boy. Go in to fetch the watch. Dogs aren't that smart. Right? Smarter than you, anyway. Oh, ouch. All right. Yay. No, you're not talking to me. On the loose, champion, I require your assistance in the matter of a great urgency. Please report to the Templar Hall and the gallows at your earliest convenience. Knight Commander Meredith. Sure. Who needs rescuing? You simply must help me. My daughter, Or Orlana, was abducted by foul bandits. One of my servants has discovered she was taken somewhere in the wounded coast. I bet you make haste for these low-born scum. Okay. Reginald Thaddeus Spink. Sphincter from Ella. Monsieur Hawk, maybe you don't remember me. We met briefly, and though I was most, it was mo the most important moment of my life, you've changed so many lives that you probably can't see keep them all straight. You rescued me from Sir Alric, and you told me to leave Kirkwall. I wanted to let you know I have. I won't say where I am now, but I am free, and I'm not looking back. I heard the, I've heard the rumors. Terrible days are coming. I pray for the safety of my family and the souls in Kirkwall especially for you and may Andraste keep you from harm okay to Ventier. dear hawk or is it now champion hawk the story of how you handled the error shock is very popular here there are a few things to Ventier's love more than the tale of canary defeat to say the imperium is a strange place would be a vast understatement men and women work magic in the streets while their slaves look on I watched my own master kill a rival uh, magister in a duel just days ago. Sometimes I look around and I think I understand Templars back at, uh, back in Kirkwall. My studies are going well. My dreams don't trouble me as much at, uh, these days. I'm, hope I'm hopeful that in time I'll master myself. I just wanted to thank you. I owe you more than my life. I owe you my mind and my future. Fenril. Okay. Fenril's still going good. Letter from, uh, in a fancy envelope. Monsieur, interest rates in the lowest city, uh, lowest they've been 200 years, making this perfect time to take out a mortgage. Oh, uh, lovely. Lending house of... Uh-huh. Okay. Right. Visit Gamlin. On the loose. Who needs rescuing and a murder of crows? Miss Anders, of the mages I know, you're the one I expected to go out in a blaze. The day is young. It was a compliment, you ass. No, it wasn't. Oh, man. I wish I could have Bethany back, damn it. What's Gamlin have to say? So you've done well for yourself. 
I had my doubts the first time I saw you, but I guess there was something to that hawk fellow Leandra ran off with after all. He certainly produced an amazing daughter. Your mother would be proud. I just wish mother had lived to see me become champion. I know, Leandra. And she'd be absolutely glowing from all the praise that's been heaped on you. I don't say this often, but we're the only family we've both got left. For a long time, I thought the Amel line in Kirkwall would end at me. I'm glad you pulled it out of the grave. Okay. Maybe that's the last time I have to see that damn jackass. Starkhaven's too pretentious for me, and Cumberland's too boring. You always say you hate commitment, but here you are, six years later, still at Hawk's side. Beverly, I thought you'd have noticed by now. I lie a lot. <laughs> okay, that's good. What am I... I'm at 71 out of 70. Okay, I need to sell some stuff. Sell all junk. Sell that. 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 Ooh, hello. I like that one. Sell the Superior Battle Axe. All right, some armor. Superior boots, we can get that, get rid of. Regular boots, we can get rid of. Ah, oh, let's see here. Sell that. Loves of the champion. Oh, wow, that just doubled that. Last Descent, sell that. Yeah, literally floof. <laughs> uh, let's see here. There's Superior Dwarven, we'll take that. Aquarian Robes, sell that. Robe of the no Notorious Pirate. Sell that. Hindsight. All right, sell that one. 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 Uh. Sell that one. Sell that one. Sell that one. <laughs> I've gotten a lot of stuff, apparently. Okay, I'm at 36 out of 70.
I need to see if I can find another backpack. Alright. Let's go to the Wounded Coasts. Let's keep going. Hold there. Who are you? The name's Evitz. As in Evitz Marauders. The folk you killed a few years back. Now you're going to die for what you've done. <laughs> There we go. Hey, Evitz. This is why your people died. Strange. I always thought I'd wind up arresting you someday. If I ever decide to get caught, Abilene, you'll be the guard I let catch me. Let catch you? <laughs> decide to get caught didn't trip you up, though. Uh -huh. Good to know. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Yay, health potions. Okay, are they down there? Alright, let's check down here. Okay. Health potion. Gotta love it. Actually, let's go this way. Okay. All right. So Isabella's back. Okay, so nothing here. Now we gotta go up that way. Cracked staff. Great has formula, fall grenade, fell grenade. We go up here. I 
I'm not the outdoors type. The sooner we're back in the city, the happier I'll be. All right. All right. Let's see what else is here. Okay, so now we have to go backwards. Oh, hey, there's some body up there. Got a Canary sword. Okay, maybe they're in the other top section there. Now, folks, if you just if you've been wondering, uh, the seat, uh, the close. Oh, hello! We got battle, and I'm not going where it says I'm supposed to. Where I'm telling it to go. Uh, what I was going to say is the um, closed caption window is something you guys can move and resize all by yourself. It does not have to stay where it is. Oh, wrong way. It's a chest. Health potion. Well, don't forget, it's three. Uh, this is three years after the previous group of uh, of events. my cursor there for a minute. You 
you there? Did my love send you? Will you take me to him? Uh, your love? Either your father didn't give me the whole story, or I really, really hope you're talking about someone else. Fainrio, the man of my dreams. These brutes intended to take my maidenhood. As they argued about who would go first, I fainted. Then Fainriel spoke to me in a vision and told me not to fear. When I awoke, the men had slain one another. Please take me to Fainriel. I want to thank him properly. Uh. I'm sorry, but I have no way to locate him. Hey, boss, it's 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 man. Okay, you see your girl and then. Your aid. Health two health potions. The walk will tire me, and we'll be reunited in my dreams. Fainriel, my love, I'm coming. Oh joy, Fainriel, what have you done? So I went the long way around for this one. You think the legend of Hawk just showing up? Removing. Yeah, true. Very true. Okay. The murder of crows. Yeah. Yeah, let's. Let's not. Let's go to the hangman. Let's see what Isabella has to say for herself. How have you been? You don't have to keep checking up on me. I'm fine. Why do you keep coming here? You're better than this. I'm comfortable here. All right? Remember what you said after the mess with the Kunari. I'm uh -huh. proud of you for doing the right thing. It may have been the right thing, but it was also the dumb thing. The relic was mine. I should have kept running. I couldn't have saved Kirkwall without you. Bullshit. You could have stormed the keep and slaughtered all those Kunari if you had to. You and Aveline. I mean, look at her. She's a woman-shaped battering ram. <laughs> the fact is, you and I have nothing in common anymore. You're a champion, and I'm just a lying, thieving snake. Whatever you think you are, I still care about you. It must have been hard to give up the relic, and I appreciate it. Whatever comes, you have my support. Well, perhaps it's time to stop hiding. And I do miss the trouble we used to get into. Tell you what, I'll be here if you need me. Okay, looks like I get I get Isabella back. Yay. Varric? What do you have to say? If you think that was bad, I should tell you about the Black Marsh. <laughs> See, when you say things like that, Blondie, it just makes me glad I didn't know you sooner. Who goes to a place named Black Marsh on purpose? Now, they called it Beer Marsh. No, still doesn't work. <laughs> You've got a point. The marsh part does cancel out anything else. Flower Marsh, Kitten Marsh. No, no good. Ah, you've got company. I'll see you later. Fuck, what can I do for you? Uh, why was Anders here? What was Anders here for? Only place in Kirkwall he can get a decent drink. Blondie comes by here and I put him on my tab. He's got some stories about his days in Ferelden that sound implausible, even to me. He's not bad for a mage. Crazy, but that's most everyone in this city.
No. Why don't you buy me a drink? I wouldn't say no to a pint. I should make you buy the drinks, O oh champion of Kirkwall. <laughs> so, what's the word in Lowtown, Varric? Nothing you don't know already. The Viscount's departure, a vacuum of power, troubles brewing. Get rid of one thread and another appears. I'm starting to think this city's in love with Crisis. Hope you're ready for it, my friend. I'm keeping Bianca close. Yeah. I suppose you're just thrilled how the Knight Commanders basically steps into the Viscount's seat. She can't stall the process forever. It's not her place. Leaving the Viscount's seat empty will just tempt people to fight for it. It will cause more trouble than it prevents. Well, you've got a brain in there after all. I was convinced that headband was to keep it from falling out. Ouch. Welcome back. You need to level up. Actually. Let's see here, where am I at? Oh. Let's max this out. That works. All right, oops, nope, want to uh, lead by example. All right, so I got her back. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to Anders Clinic. <sighs> Canary Sword. Adventures of the Black Fox. What am I doing? I'm looking for Anders when he's you in my party. No, the city guard is just another arm of the Templars. That is completely unfair. If they show up here, I'll know who to blame. That's all I'm saying. I'm sorry. I didn't mean for you to see that. I just can't be too careful. Now that the Knight Commander has basically appointed herself Viscount. I can't even imagine how difficult it is to be a mage here now. It's easy for most of them. They're long since tranquil. The mage underground is all but destroyed. Yeah. And those left have <laughs> turned to blood magic as their only option. Which Meredith knows will prevent any chance of the public taking their side. Yeah, Floof. Stories of Hawk showing up. It's like, ah. Uh... <laughs> There's still one good mage left in the city. I don't know how you continue to believe in me. How can people be so blind? The blight was stopped only with the aid of two mages. One an apostate. But it makes no difference. The Chantry set us on this path long ago. It would take something truly catastrophic to change people's thinking now. Oh, Rebel. Ouch, Pebbles. You didn't come to my solstice dinner party. Hey, guess what? You're dead. <laughs> I just don't do family gatherings. Besides, one day you and Donick will have children and I'll be the last person you want around then. Imagine all the awkward questions you'd have to answer. Oh, shit, Mother, what's a slattern? I'll just point at you and say, that's a slattern. Oh, 
Ouch! <laughs> Alright, um... Let's go see Fenris. Maker's first children. We should move on. Okay, Fenris doesn't want to talk. Justice. Ooh. There's that one. Let's visit Meryl. Come on, Daisy. You've been holed up in here for days. If you don't get some sunshine, you'll wilt. I'm not a plant, Beric. I'm fine. Just take a walk around the low town market. Get some air, and I'll stop bothering you. I know you mean well, but I have too much to do right now. I'll let you talk some sense into her, Hawk. Okay, what's going on? Beric is... very sweet. Frequently infuriating and a terrible busybody, but sweet. Were you looking for me? Nothing's wrong, is it? Huh. Nothing's the matter. I thought I'd see how you were doing. And I'm being a poor host, as usual. In the market the other day, out of the corner of my eye, I thought I saw Tamlin. I blinked, and he was gone. I don't know what it meant. Maybe nothing. Maybe I'm going mad. I miss them all. Even the Keeper. Uh-huh. I'm sure the Keeper would like to see you again. I'm sure she would. She loves to lecture. I bet her new first appreciates that. I wish I could have seen it. But it doesn't matter. I'm here now. Maybe Varric was right. Shall we go out for a bit? I could use some sunshine. Okay. And go to the keep. So, Donick was in the rose. He was not. Easy, big girl. He wasn't shopping for himself. You're lucky to have a man who wants to please you. But maybe you could indulge him more. Are there areas of intimacy you haven't explored? Why? Why do you give me these doubts? Aveline, if you shove your thumb up his ass, I win. Just... No. <laughs> Hello again, champion. Back to the barracks. I never tire of it. Let's see what you have to say. Guardsmen, duties for the week will be low town canvas. Five on, three off. City perimeter by twos. Clear by second watch. Training recruits full metal by week's end. Anything else, Captain? No. Thank you. Donick is a good man. I'm sorry, was there something you wanted? Oh? That was the honeymoon. You never said how your three weeks in Orlais went. You're right. I didn't. Ooh, shivery. Anything else? <laughs> oh! Your men could give the Templars a run for their sovereigns. They've had to. As long as there's no Viscount, the Order thinks they can bark at any man in uniform. I won't have it. The people of Kirkwall need to see themselves in their guard. Lose that connection, we're just targets. Kirkwall seems to have rallied around you. I try to keep order, and people appreciate that. Everything else is going insane. A few complaints here and there, but for the most part, 
I think everyone's just glad the guard has been stable for a few years. Mm, is there anything else going on? Just checking in. Need anything? Yes, there's something. Come back soon. I'll get into it then. Okay. I'll see you later. Of course, Hawk. All right. Well, we talked to everybody. I took the long way down. I don't know why. I just did. Okay, there's something going on with justice. Seekers of Truth. How's marriage been treating you, big girl? It's been good. No, great. I'd forgotten what it was like to be flipped ass over tits and hammered like a bent nail. To be loved. Oh, right, of course. Okay. I'm going to be trying something, and I thought you'd want to be part of it. We've both been wrong. What I did with justice was unnatural. It should never have happened. Uh, what does that mean? Is there some way to undo it? I've spent the past three years researching the methods of the Vinter Magisters. They're the only ones who have ever sought to reverse spirit possession, not just behead the victims. I believe I have a formula for a potion that can separate justice and me without killing either. What are the risks? Is it dangerous? There are always dangers with magic. But I believe this will be worth the cost. Well, that's good. Let's do it. Surely that's worth any risk it entails. I knew you'd stand behind me in this. Even if... What? Nothing. I've gathered most of what I need, but there are some... outlandish ingredients I was hoping you'd help me collect. A powder the Tavintas call Celepetre, and a small amount of Drakestone. Investigate. What's going on? Is it just a potion? Is there anything more to this ritual? No, no ritual. Just mix the ingredients up and boom. Justice and I are free. And we can take our rightful place among free mages. Drakestone? What is Drakestone? The Tavintas used to mine it for their apothecaries. There should still be deposits in the bone pit. Okay, hey, go back to the bone pit. Where would we find Celepetre? It's a crystal that forms from concentrated manure and urine. Ew. We can't just buy it somewhere. It's not used by mages here. There's no reason for any merchant to stock it. I suggest we search the sewers. There's an entrance not far from here in Darktown. Okay. No eye of Newt? We're not looking for virgin's blood or the tongue of a hanged man or anything, are we? Well, you know Tavinters. They can't throw a winter send party without a human sacrifice or two. But I promise, everything in my research says there's no blood magic involved. All right. Hmm. Murder of crows. Lost swords. Ah, the last straw. The first enchanter is openly challenged. The situation. There's a letter from the knight commander. May offer more. Okay, let us see what's happening in the sewers.
All right. What's this? Death route. There we go. I was wondering why you weren't moving. All right, let's go in the sewers. We can enter the sewers from here to look for the cellar portray. Are you ready? Let's go. Hold your nose. We'll have to get pretty close. Not a problem, Bullet. I appreciate you being here. All right, yes, Anders. I don't like you like you in that spot, but oh well. Okay. This is it. The cellar Petre should have formed right under here. Oh, I don't want to touch that. Let's see if we can find a few more deposits. Joy. Didn't find our first shot. See if we can find a few more deposits. Okay. And back around this way. And away we go. How many more deposits are we going to find? Okay. Woo. Drag 
should do it. Oops, still need to find this other deposit, which is over here. That should be plenty. Thank the maker. Sometimes the edges of these things and corners are a pain in the butt. It's a pile of bones. All right. What happens now? Go to the bone pit miners. Rather be free down here, I guess. The bone pit. We still need the Drake Stone from the Bone Pit. Which is why we're here. Brickstone mines. Are you ready to go in? Yep. Let's go. Ready as I'll ever be. We'll have to look for Drakestone deposits along the sides. This looks like a drake stone deposit. I need a scraping from the deepest part. There should be more further in. Okay. Yes, we there get their stuff, but sometimes in. we don't always get what we want. There should be more further in.
Watch your step. Big boy. There should be more further in. Okay. There's the way I wanted to go. Okay. That should be enough. <clears throat> All right. Oh, hey. I always take coin. So let's get out of here. Thank you. I wouldn't have asked just anyone to venture in there for me. There is one more thing, but we must discuss it privately. Uh huh. Thought so. Mind Massacre, Murder of Crows, Justice, alrighty then. your relic you were gone there was no reason for you to come back and face the canary i still don't have a ship i thought i could get one from a bunch of shipwrecked canary from the viscount i just got here late <laughs> i always knew you had a heart of gold Shh, don't tell anyone <laughs> all right what's going on There is one more thing I would ask of you, Hawk. And I can't tell you why. I must get inside the Chantry without being seen. Will you talk to the Grand Cleric for me? Distract her long enough for me to do what must be done. Okay. What do you want me to talk about? Food? The weather? What does it matter? No, talk of mages. Give her one final chance to hear what we have suffered. To pick a side. Perhaps she'll be more inclined to listen to you. What must be done? Tell me your plan. You would not thank me if I told you. If you support freedom for mages, help me. 
That's all I can say. Okay, sure. I won't desert you now. Your loyalty is more than I deserve. I promise, whatever happens, it's on my head. It will not come back on you. Go to the Chantry. Talk to the Grand Cleric. I will join you when I'm done. Okay. Alright, folks, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. All right. Let's see here. Go down here. Over here. And go. All right. Justice there. Let's go talk to the elves. I'm curious. Oh, wait. Um... Let's go to my home. Oh, hello, Isabella. I heard Ooh, that the what's all this? Is everything all right? Guess what? Castillon's in town, and I'm not waiting around for him to stick a knife in my vitals. We're going to get him before he gets me. Count me in. We're going to surprise Castillon. I love surprises. Unfortunately, Castillon's holed up somewhere in Kirkwall. I haven't been able to find him. I do know where Velasco is, however. That's his right hand. We just have to make him tell us where Castillon is. Somehow. Somehow? So you're saying you don't have a plan? I have something of a plan. Step one, we go to Velasco. Step two, something exciting happens. Step three, profit. Well, do you have a better idea? Uh, we kill him? If we kill him and search his body, we might find something. Or we could find nothing and get nowhere. Okay, fair enough. Can we just talk? Couldn't we just ask Velasco where Castillon is? Nicely. He's not going to reveal anything willingly. I can't risk him getting suspicious and alerting Castillon. Violence? We could hit him till he talks. You'll just end up killing him. We can use you as bait. Castillon wants you. Why not let Velasco bring you to him? And you follow me. Ooh, that's clever. I was going to suggest challenging Velasco to a riddle game and making Where's Your Boss one of the riddles. This is so much better. 
Let's do it. I'm ready whenever you are. Velasco's been spending his nights at the brothel, enjoying its many splendors. That's where we'll find him. Uh huh. Okay. Seems everyone wants some. You're a good dog. Hush. Let's use our inside barks. <laughs> inside barks. I like it. Okay. Okay. Let's go to justice. I can't believe you're still not taking sides. Have you located any Canari blades? There you go. This is what I found. Do you require gold for this task? No. I'm not doing this for the money. Very well. Good. Carry on. Okay. I didn't I thought we had more to go. Oh, okay. Wasn't thinking I was doing this one. agrees with me that's his room over there are you ready yes I think so now this needs to be convincing and you'll need to get creative call me names even hit me stick with it no matter what I do Velasco's a clever son of a bitch if you waver he'll notice you seem a little eager I'm worried about you're enjoying this a little too much. I am, aren't I? <laughs> Whatever you do, just make sure he takes me to Castillon. I'll leave a trail for you to follow. Let's go. I think you and Isabella can handle it from here. Okay. Here you Just keep this bitch. I hope you have a good reason for interrupting my private time. I have a present for Castillon. Present for what? I just want you out of the way. I thought I could trust you. Shut up. Oh. <laughs> I've waited a long time to do that. <laughs> I love to finish the job, but Castillo will never forgive me. Castillo will be pleased. He's been looking for Isabella for some time. A token of our appreciation. It's more than she is worth. <laughs> Dragging her out. To the rescue, then. Um. Yep. After I raise my level. Confirm. Let's extend that duration. Oh, good. I've got Aveline finally. Um, Indomitable.
Well, well. The champion visits the blooming rose. What an occasion. My people offer three types of service. For two sovereigns, you get the royal treatment. One sovereign gets you the standard services. For 50 silver, someone pretends to like you for an hour. Not right now. I'll need to think about it. Of course. <laughs> I can't drink in the end. Gamlin's here? I'm just here for the medicinal benefits. Uh-huh. The medicinal benefits. Oh, there it is. I go, I too go for medicinal and spare time. <laughs> There's something. The trail leads to Lota. Low town at night. No rest for the wicked. You were dead. These thugs are plaguing the streets. I don't see a problem in giving them the fight they want. Okay, let us find... Justice doesn't let me get drunk anymore. I kind of miss it. Oh, there it is.
Okay. Uh, let's see here. Let's take up all what they had dropped. So. What are these thugs doing out here now? Found another Kunari sword. This must be the way I was supposed to go. Good lord, more of these jackasses? What? We're bringing the dog out. guys just don't know when to quit. Well, Anders needs to level up. Let us um, bring up his uh, health. Oh yeah, I'll take that. In no time. Alright, let's go. Let's find Isabella. Okay. Let's see what's going on. This seems to be a very familiar tile. Why don't we work something out? If you're good, I'll tell Castillon to go easy on you. 
Contrary to popular belief, I do have standards. You're going to do whatever I want. I own you. You sure about that? You! I knew the bitch was up to something! Kill them! Trap. Velasco okay. sent word to Castillon. He's on his way. Let's look around first. I want to know why he's in Kirkwall. Okay. Well, I want to collect all the um, loot off the skate. Okay. Ah, there's a chest here. Let's take that. There's a chest here. Incriminating documents. So Castillon's looking to expand his slaving business. Why am I not surprised? These documents should go to the guard. We'd at least arrest his accomplices. Mm -hmm. And Velasco told me you were all tied up. A lovely present just waiting to be opened. I see he's paid for that little mistake. What a pretty smear he makes. Well played, Isabella. Crossed and double crossed. You want to talk? Maybe we should talk about these documents. Slavery in the free marches? They're not going to like that. Get to the point. Give me your ship and your word to leave me alone, and you can take these papers and go. Uh-huh. Don't you want to kill him? If you want the ship, can't we just kill him and take it? You don't just kill a man and take his ship. That's crude and amateurish. How will he tell everyone how I bested him if he's dead? Okay. Can you trust him? He trades people for money. Castillon's a businessman, and this is a business deal. He'll keep his end of the bargain. This is unexpected. What happened to getting rid of Castillon? I am getting rid of him. Through peaceful means. Coming from her, that's priceless. I saw the ship docked in the harbor, Castillon. She is splendid. I want her. Give me the documents, and you can have the ship. And you will never hear from me again. Swear it. I swear it on my mother's grave. Give me the documents. Evelyn is not going to like this. You've made your decision, Isabella. Do as you wish. The ship is yours. Let me say, my dear, that you would make a remarkable ally for any man able to tame you. Our business is hereby concluded. Forever. 
Be well, Isabella. Okay. He didn't deserve to walk free. He'll get what's coming to him someday. Doesn't need to be at my hand. How does it feel to have finally gotten the ship of your dreams? Better than three greased up sailors. <laughs> I really should haul anchor first thing tomorrow morning, but I don't know. I've taken a shine to Kirkwall and some of the people in it. <laughs> I might stick around. Come on. Alrighty then. Okay. Which one of you idiots stepped on that? Not me. Okay. Let's go ahead and go out. Well, Isabella needs to level up. Attributes, cunning. Constitution. That's full. Bring that up. No, let's not do that. Let's do this. Okay. All right, now we've got everybody up and running. We are going to go deal with justice. I think they kind of missed something on the justice line, though. I really do think that they did. They could have done so much more with it. I don't know how you live the way you do, blithely ignoring the consequences of your actions. This is about the canary thing, isn't it? I'm not ignoring it. I just recognize that it happened years ago. There's this fantastic thing called moving on. You should try it sometime. Has it occurred to you that Kirkwall is only just recovering from the canary attack? And you want me to, what, flog myself daily? Has it occurred to you that maybe there's no justice in the world, other than that voice you keep in your head? All right. Have you located any Canari blades? This is what I found. If you find more, bring them to me. Okay, so there is more to it. All right. Let's see what's going on. I'll find you as soon as I'm done. Thank you. Distract the Grand Cleric so Anders can complete his plan. You know, Isabella, if someone had told me that I'd put up with you for all these years, I'd have punched them flat. And if someone had told me I'd still be here, I'd have done the same. You have your ship. What's stopping you? And what would you do without me as a constant headache in the road? Someone would rush to fill the hole. You know, like you never left. That's my girl. 
Maybe you win once in a while. <laughs> the champion done a great herself. service to the city, but I see she isn't married yet either. Maybe there's still hope for the hero. Okay, am I going the right way? Maker's blessing, champion. Have you come to pray? Have you thought about which side you'll take? Between the mages and Templars? It's no secret that you count apostates among your friends, champion. You have done much to fan the flames of rebellion here. We must give Meredith and Orsino time to work out their differences. No good can come of showing favor to one side. The Maker created mages. Why doesn't he protect them? I feel for the mages, I do. I would not wish to be locked in the gallows. But I cannot take sides. We are all the Maker's creatures, but magic allows abuses beyond the scope of mortals. I only hope I can balance the needs of everyone. For if it comes to war, it is the people of this city who will lose. Correct. There you are. I've been looking for you all over. Your Grace? Your soul is troubled, child. I hope you found a balm for it here. All right, let's see what happened. There's Anders. I cannot tell you how good it feels for a spirit to fulfill its function. The waiting is over. I am finally seeking justice. And he is exultant. There is no ecstasy humankind can feel to match. Uh, what happened in the Chantry? Are you going to tell me what you did? You are Kirkwall's champion. You can better aid our cause in that role than by aligning yourself with me too closely here. You're scaring me. You sound possessed. I am possessed. And it's never felt better. Even justice bows to you for the faith you have shown us. A victory for mages will be a victory for you. Uh, interesting. Okay. I wanted you to have this. What's that? A pillow? Hand embroidered by my mother. The only thing of hers they let me keep when I went to the circle. Why in the name of Andraste would you give that to me? You've been a good friend, Varric. Uh-uh. You keep your pillow, Blondie. And may you have many more dreams of killing Templars on it. Hawk. I didn't expect you here. Uh-oh. But let me take this time to tell you how much I respect you. You've stood by me when I gave you every reason to turn away. Just remember, whatever happens, I wanted you to know that. Okay, what's going on? Why are you talking like this? He'll still be here, you know. Justice. Long after you and I are gone. It doesn't mean the same thing to a spirit. He'll just go back to the Fade. You've been a good friend. No, I haven't. And I'm sorry. I was hoping we'd find a better way, but... Justice and vengeance are too intertwined. I can't tell one from the other. You have been a better friend than I ever thought to have. Your support has meant the world to me. Armor. Dragon scale boots. Ooh, some strength needed. Anders back in. Mm, excuse me. There is justice in the world. Is there? You want to free the mages. Let 
Let's say you do. But to get there, you kill a bunch of innocent people. What about them? Don't they then deserve justice? Yes. And then what? Where does it end? It's like a bar brawl. People are continuously pulled into the fray, and nobody remembers why it started. Justice is an idea. It makes sense in a world of ideas, not an hour. In a way, that is correct. Okay. Let's go to the gallows. Let's advance the storyline a little bit. Let's see here, which way am I going? Nope, nope, I need to go this way. They put the Tranquil on display out here to intimidate other mages. You can recognize the icons in the quick bar anytime except during combat, during, oh. Captain Cullen. Champion, welcome. What is this urgent matter you spoke of? There was an incident within the gallows. A number of phylacteries were destroyed, and several mages took the opportunity to escape. We've recovered most of the fugitives. However, I require your assistance in tracking down the last three. Tell me about the incident. How did the phylacteries get destroyed? An insurrection. Several of my own Templars orchestrated the escape, presumably out of sympathy for the mages. They turned their backs on their duty and endangered their charges, as well as the city. Thankfully, most who escaped fled to their families and offered no resistance. The last three are proving more difficult. Uh, can't your Templars do it? Since you're turning to me, should I assume the Templars all suddenly disappeared? The apostates are being sheltered by their families. Some have been reluctant to talk to Templars. But you are another matter. The people of Kirkwall trust you, Champion. They will be more honest for you than for us. Oh. I'm not doing your job for you. You claim to have Kirkwall's interests at heart? Show it. Prove that you are champion in more than just name. With the influence you wield in this city, champion, it is crucial you understand just what we face. Talk to these mages' families. Investigate for yourself whether they need be recaptured. And if they don't? You aren't afraid of what I'll do. I hope you'll do the right thing. You do not approve of my methods. But perhaps you will change your mind when you see firsthand how dangerous these apostates are. And what would it take to change your mind? Speak to my assistant, Elsa. She can tell you whatever you need to know about the fugitives. I bid you good day, champion. Okay, let's talk to Elsa. Good day, Champion of Kirkwall. Knight Commander Meredith has informed me that you will be tracking down the apostates on behalf of the Templars. There are three of them. Huon, Emil, and Evelina. Okay. Why does Meredith have a tranquil assistant? She flaunts what she can do to mages. She likes to rub our faces in it. The Knight Commander believes Tranquil Mages to be efficient and single-minded. I, in particular, am extremely organized. Okay, is blood magic involved? Are the Apostates blood mages? The Knight Commander suspects this, yes. But she does not know for certain. The Knight Commander tends to assume all Apostates practice blood magic. She prefers to err on the side of caution. Alright, tell me about Huon. I want to hear about Huon. Huon is an elf. He was apprehended in the alienage ten years ago. 
His wife, Nisa, works for a dressmaker in Lowtown. What does Nisa know? Have the Templars spoken to her? Yes. Nisa insists she has not seen Huon since he joined the Circle. Okay. He's from the Alienage? Could Huon be hiding among the other elves in the Alienage? The Templars' searches uncovered nothing. The Templars have also concluded that few other elves would risk hiding him. Huon was taken many years ago. Most of the Alienage's inhabitants do not even know him. All right. What about Emile? Tell me what you know about Emile. The second apostate is Emile de Lancey, fifth son of the Comte de Lancey. Out of Hightown, some of our more vocal and delicate nobility. They are home in the evenings authoring complaints. Uh-huh. Tell me about the family. What do you know about the de Lancey's? Comte Guillaume de Lancey is a minor noble from Orlais. He and his wife came to the Free Marches over three decades ago. Emile was born in Kirkwall and sent to the Circle at age six. Have they been questioned? What have they said to the Templars? The Comte and Comtesse say they have not seen Emile since he was a child. Okay, and who is Evelina? What do you know about Evelina? Evelina was trained for eight years in the Circle in Ferelden. She was last seen in her former residence among the refugee community in Darktown. Ferelden? How did she come to be in Kirkwall? Evelina claims to have fled the Blight, not the Circle. She presented herself to the First Enchanter on her arrival and asked to take her place here. That doesn't sound like a fugitive. Anything else? Our files indicate she petitioned Meredith for financial support of numerous other pre-adolescent Blight survivors. Last scene? Did the Templars run into her in Darktown? Yes, they tracked her there, but she killed several pursuers. The Templars believe she is the most dangerous apostate. Uh-huh. I have all the information I require for now. Good luck on your search, Champion of Kirkwall. Okay. Let's see what we got. The loose on the loose. Loose. Let's go back to the bone pit. Let's investigate what happened there, because it did not look I pretty. Think we're better off focusing on the task at hand. Hello. High Dragon, too.
right. Come on, dragons. Sorry, I got caught up in this whole fight and trying to figure out everything. But, oh boy. This is the most I've seen dragons in this game. Dragons. Let's take care of the small guys. Me, huh? How does that feel? I'll take a health potion. I need help here. Yeah, you do. You need health. Anders, you're not doing your job. some health. Give me some health. Alright, this dragon is almost done. So am I.
Nice! Just coin, I'll take it now. Most of it is. I mean, these were dragons. Health potions, too. Stanima stuff, that, that's good. I think that one is an item. Okay, so I can come back to it later. I mean, in the last one, the dragons... The, the one thing I'm noticing about this game, and this is actually um, something interesting, is the first Dragon Age, you the dragon was a focus. In this one, the dragon isn't. The focus is the Chantry, uh, the Seeker, and the Champion. It's interesting. To say the least. Alright. Go to the high town market. Real quick. Uh, Alright. Let's sell all our junk. Um, yeah, we'll take all of that. Uh, we'll take all of that too. I got 12 injury kits, I'm good. Let's talk to Hubert. A dragon attacked your mine. Everyone is dead. Dear Maker, what of my equipment? Did it seem salvageable? Um, everything was raised. The dragon scorched every last cart and shovel. Oh, my heart. So many years of investment. I am ruined. Ruined. I'm sorry, champion. I appreciate your help, but I sank all my coin into that rotten mine. I have nothing left to pay you. Let's see here. Take mine. Yeah. Give me the bone pit. Perhaps in a few years I can get it back in order. What? <laughs> Fine. Take it. I wash my hands of this cursed venture. Okay, what the hell? Not it was not expected. No, nope, I can go this way. something to wet your teeth on oh freshly confiscated mutton just for you have at it just checking on my best guardsman he's helping the men to learn healthy respect and how to run hmm. <laughs> okay
All right. Look, it's okay. Okay, well, tonight has been very interesting. We got through another major portion of Dragon Age. Um, I do want to say, uh, please stick around because I am going to give us a raid here. And um, I want to say thank you all for being here. Whether or not you were chatting, whether or not you were uh, lurking, for whatever reason, you all being here is all I care about because, let me tell you, it's fun. I know it's tough out there right now, especially in the U.S. and definitely all over the world. So I understand everyone who comes in here. I also understand no one... Um, always has a lot of money but i am going to say it there are avenues to support me if you want to it is never required you can uh, subscribe to the channel that helps you can send uh, donate bits or you can uh, donate through the panel down below and um, you'd be more uh, everything is appreciated and it goes back into the stream in one way or the other um, when it comes here which should be around april 10th I will have Final Fantasy VII Remake, and uh, the first part, the first installment of it. <laughs> apparently, it's going to be several installments, so apparently it's a lot more than the original. So, there's going to be a lot of extra stuff in there, so it's going to be interesting to see. I've got all that, um, but definitely Mass Effect 2 ends next this coming Sunday. And Mass Effect 3 starts this Sunday. So definitely be here 6 p.m. Eastern on Sunday for that. Because let me tell you, that suicide mission is one hell of a mission. And then afterwards, there's another mission. And it's got some interesting information if you're curious about Mass Effect uh, lore. Um, and then we'll start Mass Effect 3. We'll go through the uh, intro. We'll go into the... Um, character build and get that started as well so we'll definitely have all that because we really only have three and a third uh missions left um to do and on thursday uh tuesday i am still debating on what i will run it will either it will not be star wars the old republic this week um well i shouldn't say will not it's possible that we'll run that but probably not uh and don't forget i will be coming online and um working outside of the normal stream hours on either Friday uh, tomorrow or on um, Saturday. Maybe both. I don't know. Uh, it just, to be honest, it's uh, it keeps me busy. So definitely there. We will continue our run through Hildeberg Hawk on next Thursday uh, with Dragon Age 2. So we're going to go ahead and wait a minute. Let me check. That didn't look good. Okay. We're actually going to, uh, speaking of Final Fantasy VII, we're going to go to somebody streaming Final Fantasy VII. We raided her last time. Uh, we'll raid Miss White Mage again tonight. And um, she is playing the original Final Fantasy VII. So it's got some interesting graphics. But remember the time frame it came out and what it came out on. So thank you all very much for being here. I'm going to go ahead and start this raid. You all have a great evening and a great weekend. I'll see you uh, this weekend. And definitely, sun if I don't see you before then, Sunday evening, 6 p.m. Eastern. So raid, miss, oops, would help if I have fingers on the right page. White mage. Good night, everyone.